Welcome back to Don't Diecast, Diecast family. We're at Walmart. Let's see what this Walmart out here in Auburn has for us. All right, Don't Diecast family. I am seeing some C case. It looks like I'm seeing. Well, oh, that's C case as well. So that Camaro SS would have been B cases super. But we're gonna have to go through a little of this down here and uh, see what we can find. We'll stack up a bunch of cars. There's a Porsche. Um, there's the awesome Tahoe. There's the yellow Porsche down in here. Not too bad looking. We got the Cayman. This is a hard one to find. The GT4. Um, and a Proton Saga down there. Alright, let's go through some of these up here. We got the Rock and Railer. We got the, uh, the train. We got the HKS truck. This is a cool little car, the uh, El Segundo Coupe. We got the Low Lux. We got the uh, the off-road truck back there. We got the Hot Weiler, uh, Cloak and Dagger, a Limited Grip. There's another train. There's an AK HKS. There's a Porsche. There's a Corvette. Another Corvette. What's way in the back in there? I almost can't tell. I can feel it though. It's a uh, it's a scooter. All right, this one's gonna be hard to look through because this thing is pushed in the corner like nuts. Maybe we'll go underneath. We got the uh, Croc Rod, Proton Saga, Brick and Mortar. What else do we got? Nissan Z. Uh, the Batmobile back there. What else? And a purple dune racer thing again. All right, we got the Camaro. Try to pull some of these down that are off the pegs. There's another Proton Saga. There is one of the, uh, the little ride cars that all link together. There is the Mad Mike. Um, Hot Weiler, another purple car. Rock and Roller, Limited Grip. Off-road, there is a, uh, a Barbie car right there. What else do we got? A Hummer, limited grip. Not looking like too much else down in here. We'll take a look. The Ultimate T-Rex Transporter Audi. Dodge D100, limited grip, Stingray, head gasket. Hot wired. Proton Saga. Um, Dodge D100, Cloak and Dagger, Cloud Cutter, Raymac. Nothing, you guys. All right, but we can move up here, and I'm seeing some cool stuff because here is the new Gran Turismo. Now, it's not looking like a full set because there is a BMW, a GTR, a Mustang, a Porsche 911, and a Toyota GR Supra. And right now, we have the Porsche 911. We have the Mustang, and it looks like those are the only two back here. We got a bunch of the Porsche set. There is the uh, 356 Speedster, the black, a bunch more black 944s. Um, what else do we got back here? A couple of the 911s and uh, what is that? Like a 935. Yep. And then I'm looking over here. I'm like neon speeders stacked up. They must have got a whole new set because there are Datsuns galore in here. One, two, three, four. And we got the uh, the awesome Integra. Do they have the Eclipse in here? Doesn't look like the, or yeah, the Eclipse. Wow, there's another Datsun. Another Integra, the 350. Let's take a look, the S2000s. Yeah, but no Eclipses. That one is a hard to find, you guys. All right, some Matchbox, some moving parts. Nothing too crazy. And then let's get on to the premiums. All right, guys, rolling up to the premiums. I see they got some boulevards here. Now, let's see if they got one of everything because I see some Porsches, and the Porsches are a hot one. But what else was, oh, the Honda Accord. Now, I bet you there is none of those left in here. That is a cool one. I grabbed two when I saw the set at first. But here's the rest of the, uh, the Fords, the Celicas, and the Porsches. I can't believe nobody took the three fives. This is a great looking Porsche right here, you guys. I mean, 
yeah, I, I don't know what else to say about it. It's great looking. We got some of the uh, off-road. We got some of the classics and the canyons. We got some Forza, some Thundercats, some Fast and the Furious. We got some of the, uh, the team transports, but nothing too new. Let's take a look at some of these and see if there's any blue on those Starship Selects. It doesn't look like it. What else do we got up here? Some green light. We got some Kings of Crunch green light. That's a new Mopar Magic, it looks like. There's a Dream Master. Let's take a look at these. There's a Kevin Hartwick right behind it. And this is in the flat red. So it's it's kind of hard to tell, especially on that one. But it it's uh, that is not a chase, but they do have a chase of that. You just got to keep your eyes open. All right, what else are we going to look through? We'll look at some of these just trucks to see if we see any colorful wheels. There's some yellow rims, some gold, black. I got some Hummers. All right, what else have we got up here? Some muscle machines. We got some M2 paper carded. We got some M2 plastic carded. Rolling all over the place. Now this guy was a hard one to tell. You really got to take a look and make sure that those wheels aren't chromy red. And we got a bunch of Fantas and a bunch of haulers, a bunch of lifts. Let's start up top. Maybe we can get through some of these with one hand because it's getting a little tight down towards the bottom here. Let's see if we can see some of these paper carded M2s. 660. Ooh, there's the street machine. What else have we got? The wind and the uh, the belly tanker down there. Got another belly tanker, another belly tanker. There is the Chevy Camaro in all the gray. There's a Camaro SS in blue and white looking real nice. The Chrysler, Camaro, and a Clipper Cargo again. Let's move down to these. There are so many M2 haulers around here, you guys. It is crazy. We got some of the bazooka. We got some tab. They're all kind of stacked a little odd on top of each other, so it's hard to pull them all off in twos without having that happen. And I don't want them to fall everywhere. There's a Coke. There's some more tab. God, that gold on the tab, it gets me every time thinking that that's a chase. That is not the chase, you guys. All right. Now the Mr. Pib, that would be awesome in gold. And there's another Mr. Pib and another Coca-Cola. Let's slide those back in, and I see a whole bunch more down here. Let's see if we can pull some of these out down here without causing an avalanche. They have a ton. Wow. A ton might have been an understatement. There's the Schwinn. There's another Quaker State. Some more Corvettes. Some Ford Motor Company with the, uh, the Bronco. There's some Mr. Or Mr. Pib, that's Bazooka Joe and some Schwinn. All right. They're kind of hiding back here, but behind the big time muscle, there we go. We have the Shell racing truck, the Voodoo Hemi Cuda, and another Voodoo Hemi Cuda down there. Man, that Shell racing truck is so nice. I love it. The Cheyenne 10. Let's see if we can pull apart some of these M2s. There's the Bronco. The uh, Bel Air Gasser, the Datsun 510. What do we got back there? Pennzoil. What do we got for this? Pennzoil, Dinty Moors. There's another Sweetheart's Bronco. Let's see if I can pull the rest of these out. There's a Sweetheart's Van down there, all white wheels. We'd be looking for something with some pink wheels to it. And then what do we got? So we got some more back here. Let's try to get some of these out of the way. There's the Datsun. There is the funny car. Now this would have been the, I mean, the absolute coolest in the uh, the raw. And we got a Wyan down there. All right. Okay, we put everything back. I want to check up here. I see two more lifts. We'll take a look at those. All right, we got a tab and a shell. Still blows me away. This Auburn. I put them up here. They still have three Darth Vader Tie Fi Advanced chases. There's the regulars with the red top, red numbering, blue, blue, blue. 
These guys all have battle damage on them. These are all chases, you guys. Pretty cool. I knew there was one more place we could look. Now, we searched through this before. There is the uh, C-Case, would be Super. Not the Super, though, obviously. Um, and then we got some Camaro sitting down here, which, um, what case are these? C-Case. So, non-Super, just extra Camaros. Proton Sagas. There is a bunch of good cars, don't get me wrong, but I believe we went through this last time. I don't know if they added anything new in here. So we'll try to pop around a little bit and see what we can see. Maybe I'll try to pull a couple handfuls of cars out of the bin. There is the most stash. There is the awesome Miata. What else? The bus. That's it. Let me dig through here. Let's see what we can find. Alright, nothing else too crazy in there other than like Mod Rod and a couple more Miatas. But we're going to leave that in there and keep it moving. Last but not least, they had a couple more Porsches hanging out over here. We'll take a look through those. Just a bunch more 935s. And a bunch of Mandalorian with a couple Ninja Turtles and some 100th Anniversary mixed in there. And we are all out of Hot Wheels in here. All right, you guys, I'm grabbing some of the cars from the Gran Turismo set, the only two that they had left. And I realized that my Nissan Skyline from the Neon Speeders had a super crack blister, so I got to grab another one of those. I will see you guys at another Walmart. All right, we, this isn't Walmart, this is Penny Lane, you guys. Super cool, love this antique shop. Let's see what they got inside. Starting out, let's pop into John's toy shop. He's got some cool green light, tons of green light stuff here. We even have the uh, the awesome green light dioramas, the weekend workshop, and there is the police station, Florida Highway Patrol. I actually have the Florida Highway Patrol one myself. I'm thinking about getting that Mopar one because that's really cool. And then he's got just tons and tons of green light for great prices you guys tons of police cars that you can add to your diorama if you want to and trust me there's plenty of mopar that we could add to that mopar one as well i want to double check that one back there now he usually doesn't have any chases in here there are some sometimes you know randomly inserted in here but they're also priced accordingly, just so you know. It's not like you go to Walmart and somebody just, you know, put out a, a chase and it's the same same price. It doesn't work like that here. All right, so we'll keep on going through. There are some, uh, what is that, New York State? Yep. Um, what are they? State Troopers. There's Ace Ventura, the Jeepster. <laughs> There's some low riders. There's a bunch of stuff here, you guys. It's like impossible to go through all of it, but we'll scan through and look at a couple more things. They got tons of farm equipment, if you guys are into that. Tons of lifts, even more low riders down here. Look at this guy, that is super pretty. I, uh, I don't know. Is that supposed to be like that? Or is that a, a green light red target? I don't know. I'm going to have to look that up. But either way, I don't know. The red in there and everything, it looks looks great. We got the California Lowriders, Chevy Impala. That's another really good looking one. Wow. The Biscayne. And then what's back there? The Cadillac Sedan DeVille. Holy cow. These low riders are hot. All right, let's pop back up here a little bit. Take a look at some of these lifts. They got tons of uh, stuff for inside the shop if you're getting into dioramas. And just insane, insane amount of cars. Golf, Jeep, there's just everything you could possibly look for for green light here. There's other places I want to get to in here, so let's get over there. All right, you guys, another corner in here that is really cool. 
is this spot right here. They always have some great cars through here. Stuff that's hard to find. Stuff that maybe you've never seen before. And all at really good prices. This is actually the chase down here. If you guys can see the, the kind of shine that that has to it versus the regulars that we see. And, you know, for 10 bucks, not bad at all. We got some Johnny Lightnings up here, some of the 55th anniversary, and then tons of premiums. There's some of the new boulevards hanging out up there. And then stuff that I haven't even seen yet. Here's some of the new Fast and the Furious. Here's the Torino Sprinter. That is super cool. The Honda NSX Type R. That's gorgeous. And then the Ford RS 2000. Crazy. We got some moving parts. We got tons of treasure hunts down here. I think almost all of these all the way up to there are treasure hunts. And then, you know, keeping it moving. We got the non or non super Camaro. That's a treasure hunt. Civic SI. Look at that for 250. And then Skylines for 250. Very reasonable, you guys. I mean, you can't find that anywhere else. We got a bunch of M2s down here. Some green light. We got a bunch of two packs. We got a couple lifts. Look at this. Gold Liberty Walk Silva 225. Man, a bunch more moving parts down here. It's got some M2s. Got some Winter Circle. Got some more green light through here. Has protectors. Look at all the M2s down here. M2 and green light. And then a whole bin. More in the display cases. And then I didn't even scan all the cars that are down through here. Now, none of them are really old by any means. But if you're missing out on something from this year, they're, they're here. All the Zamex, all sorts of stuff. All right, more places to show. This is another seller here with some really awesome cars. He has a couple older cars. If there's anything you know you're looking for from the past years and stuff like that he has a pretty good amount of stuff Cobra concept he's got a couple uh, premiums and everything is always reasonably priced here you guys what is this a six dollar premium I don't even think you can get it at Walmart for that much money so you guys you're supporting local people and you're getting yourself a great deal so if you get a chance to stop out at a place like this, please do. And you never know, there's places all around you. And you just really got to look. Go on the Google, search them up, see if you can find yourself a little co-op. Wow, that thing is gorgeous, right? Look at the colors on that, 250 Oh, yeah. I mean, just uh, get out there, see what you can find, you guys. There it is again. Man, some color variations. Look at this big old guy. There's a Hudson Hornet. I have the super of that Hudson Hornet with all the gold and everything. Um, yeah, but like I said, just tons of stuff here. Gorgeous black and gold Batroka. And you just, uh, you never know what you'll find here. They get in new stuff all the time. I found green light chases here. And then they have just tons on the table as well. Got really older cars old blue cards and some new stuff like I said all reasonably priced there's another place upstairs I got to show you guys all right family last stop is this awesome new seller upstairs in here he has a ton of great stuff I mean some exclusive cars some cars I've never seen before premiums there's the Econoline pickup there's an awesome Volkswagen square back. What is that? Uh, AMC Javelin. They just did the Javelin for, our, that, for the RLC. And honestly, I think this Javelin looks a little bit better. <laughs> um, they got tons of stuff. These old Matchbox. We got the Hot Wheels Forza Xbox car. I mean, that's, that's something you don't see every day. Got a ton of different cars. I mean, the old school Batman Batmobile. Um, a Canon car, all the different Batmobile 
this one's super cool the bat rod i'm like i try to get all the motorcycles i definitely do not have that one um and then we got all the matchbox collectors older matchboxes forza there we go there's a mystery machine and guys they're all pretty reasonably priced this one's 1750 but if you know that's a pretty expensive car right there he's got tons of older matchbox some new stuff i mean it's it's pretty awesome to be able to go through all of this and i mean just crazy crazy stuff I'm, i don't want to go too insane because we'll sit here going through the pegs all day long but we might be able to do a quick run through there's a creature i remember this shark from back in the day when i had my my original hot wheels cars um yeah and see they get deep in here you guys it's it's not easy to take a look at all these who's this guy old truck yeah ford f-150 like yellow tint window chrome bottom that's a that's a different one what else pike peak celica you guys there's just a bunch of cool cars look at this mustang right here convertible yeah what is that is that a corvette what is that come out of there that is a 40 something i don't know what that is hmm all right i thought it might have been a uh a ferrari for a second there's a jaguar look at this thing fandango there's a bunch of cool cars through here like i said i don't know we might end up going through all these just really quickly what is that oh my goodness see so guys finding stuff like this that is sid mead's centennial 400 limo what in the world that thing is insane you could see like the motor and speakers i don't what that is nuts what else do we got f1 cars we got some dragged out cars back there uh some police vehicles what is that that's pretty that dodge charger got a really nice paint on it um what is that camaro concept back before they even knew that this was going to be the final camaro we got like a joker looking car back there the heat fleet series now i'm probably going by some pretty cool cars that you guys might know a little bit more about but me i'm just looking at them and i'm like they're just cool looking um you guys leave it in the comments if you see something that's really neat here that you think we should pick up and we can always use it for something in the giveaway you know just let me know what you guys think um yeah okay it's getting to be a lot of cars but we're almost done because then we're getting out of here and we're gonna head to another walmart look at this guy the ford focus super dragged out all right mustangs we're so close to the end i would hate to quit on you guys right now cadillacs i don't even know what you are a thumbs mana what is this a holden a ford some crazy big wheels wow even this camera rig is getting getting kind of heavy right about now all right that's gonna be it for all of these look at that that's actually pretty cool we'll go through the back side b fairinger i don't know there's some pretty good looking cars they're pretty old but i don't know much about the old cars i just know what to look for for the new stuff it's got some pretty cool exclusives down on the table too this is a throwback for me the andy griffith show i used to watch with this with my dad all the time uh it's just super cool there's some easter exclusives down here i was looking at this monte carlo off-road donk and like the colors on it with those flames are are pretty cool that's a neat one got the pikes peak celica a couple different cars 
and some motorcycles up here. This Ducati 1199, really good looking. And this uh, this Bone Speeder is a cool variation of the Bone Shaker. Looks really cool. And then color shifters, other matchbox, just pretty cool over in this corner in general, you guys. All right, let's get out of here. All right, we're getting out of here. I'm sure we're going to end up at Walmart this time. I'll see you there. All right, Diecast family, we made it to our last stop, Walmart, Newark. Let's see what they got in here. All right, don't Diecast family, getting in here. They have a couple of cars up on the pegs. Doesn't look like they have a lower dump in, unfortunately. So this is this is it. Once we go through this, that's all the Hot Wheels that they have, at least regular, you know, um, dollar eighteen Hot Wheels. We got some premiums over on the other side. We can definitely take a look at though. All right, I'm not seeing much of anything. Hologram buses, uh, Baja Bison uh, lifeguards. There's a beautiful little Subaru right here who doesn't love that great looking little car all right going through the rest of this um yeah nothing too crazy you guys now over here they have a ton of the Porsche set but I don't see anything in green in that last Porsche that thing is a monster to try to find I'm glad like I said that I ended up getting one when they first came out i didn't even know it was a chase or anything like that but they got some of the uh, j imports they got a couple neon speeders left over there's some celicas and a uh, 350z we got a couple of matchbox not a whole ton some moving parts some old new all sorts of moving parts over there we got some mini cooper sets and then we can shift over to premiums. All right, family, don't forget we have the 6,500 subscriber giveaway going on. That means when you see a car name like this one, you take that car name in and you enter it into my email address. My email address is don'tdiecast at yahoo.com. You guys send it in there with your name or your username or screen name, whatever you would like me to call you. And that will be your one entry into the giveaway from this video so you guys good luck and let's get back to the video all right you guys there's quite a bit here looks like they got the new boulevard set in at one point um where are the rest of these is there any more nascar authentics because i think just brad right here wave two would have been the chase i actually found him no so this is number seven. Oh, here they all are tons of them we'll have to go through that and take a look so is this all wave three? So the 14 Chase Briscoe right here. He is not anything crazy red. We'll still look through and see if we can find any more numbers that we know are Chase cars. We'll take a look. Austin, no. Then we've got the Sunny D. Oh no, that's not even the Sunny D. That's Tire Pros. I like the Sunny D car though. All right. Daniel Suarez and that is it there are two Porsche 935s up here along with one of the Fords then we got some Forza a couple of the uh, Fast and the Furious cars left over a bunch of Alphas some of the off-road some of the modern classics this is a great car from the modern classics the uh, Volkswagen Corrado VR6. And we got the Abrith, another Miata. Got the Thundercats up here, some Back to the Future. Moon Eyes, Belly Tankers. Some more paper carded M2s. There's another Belly Tanker, Corvettes. And we got a couple of lifts down here. We can take a look at some of the Volkswagens because that's like all they have. Holy cow. And then a Coke premium down there. All right, let's see what's left down here in some of these M2s. There is a Ram Charger, and there's the Kennedy Brothers. Three-window coupe down there. Oh, there's that cool Fair Lady Z right there in the VP Racing livery. There's a Datsun up top. There's another Fair Lady. 
and a shell truck. All right, there's another Chrysler. There's a Royal Lancer. I saw one of you guys found this in the chase and showed me all the gold. That is super cool. We got the uh, Econoline delivery van. We got the Schwinn delivery Econoline truck. The Volkswagen and some corn nuts with some Barracudas stacked on top. I'm still trying to keep an eye open for the new pink slips to be coming out. There's nothing new in here, but I did see up here is one of the old school all pink Porsches. And that was a pretty cool one. But other than that, we are all done in here. Like always, you guys know I had a great time hunting with you. I will catch you on the next one. Good luck out there. Peace out.